Yo, what is good, YouTube? Mad Dubs here, back with another video, guys. We have some breaking news coming out of New York. The Giants have just signed an undrafted free agent in Troy Brown out of Ole Miss in Central Michigan. These highlights you're seeing right now is when he played for Central Michigan. He played there four years. Uh, but before we talk about more or get more into depth in Troy Brown and what he's going to bring to the Giants, make sure you guys do me a favor. Smash that like button. Subscribe if you're new. Join the family. I will be covering the entire NFL offseason. So join the family. Turn on post notifications so you guys notified every time we post some breaking news in the NFL. But without any further do let's get into the video so troy brown is a 6 220 pound uh, middle linebacker but the good thing about him is he has experience in a lot of different places now in 2022 he broke out for Ole miss where he had 93 tackles 44 solo five pass deflections a uh, half a sack one forced fumble but that you go back further 2021 he had one sack 2020 he had four and a half sacks you go back to 2019, he had three interceptions. You go back to 2018, he had one interception. So this is a guy, Troy Brown, who can play multiple different positions. He's been a four-year starter over his uh, you know, collegiate career. He's played weak side. He's played middle. He's played inside. Overall, he just has amazing in instincts and awareness, as you should have as a middle linebacker. But like we said, he can play in multiple. He can get to the quarterback. He can drop back in coverage. He can get um, you know, reads. He can... Um, Swat down balls at the line of scrimmage. He can do whatever you need him to do. Make big time tackles like that one. I mean, this guy could be all over the field. And to get him as an undrafted free agent is kind of a... Uh it's, it's alarming, like not not for the Giants, but for the rest of the NFL. Like this guy is a baller. He had some issues tackling early in his career, but has developed over the past couple of seasons, which only tells you that this guy has the ability to get better and better and better down the line and could become a potential starter if he develops with the right pieces or with the right, um, you know, coaching and staff. If they help him enough, this dude could become a nice little starter for the Giants. Hit that like button, subscribe if you're new, join the family, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. Thank you